Uh, welcome back to uh, to uh, 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 well, welcome back to Gail's uh, roof issue part two. Part two. <laughs> Good news, folks. The coffee's starting to kick in. Coffee's starting to kick in. Anyway, here just a couple things I want to address really quick, and and just so we all understand this, I have two different roof materials, uh, wall materials right here, and you'll notice that you'll know that if you you send this to layout. You send this to layout with a uh, back clip cross section. You will see these two lines here, which is a bit disconcerting, which isn't good. I mean, I understand why it's there, and it makes a lot of sense. But I, I just want to show you something that can, and I've done this before, but I, I want to show you something so you, so so you guys who don't understand this can understand this better. I'm going to change it so instead of seeing the edge of this green siding here, I'm going to see the edge of the brown siding here. So if I take this wall right here. You and send it back a uh, structure uh, through through. Watch this. Now it's the brown siding that's showing through. See that? Because it goes through. Now there is another easy fix to this. Uh, another fix to that, and that is. Uh, let's see if I can do this right. You. Uh, define. If you insert if you add a little paint layer there like uh, 0.25 and make that uh, siding SID okay okay now if I take this wall right here which is the brown wall you define oh Oh, you sort of did it already, you sneaky little person, you. I think. Oh, but it's... Oh, you painted the wall. Did you paint that wall? I think you got the right idea here, but I think you painted that wall. Uh, you can do it. I mean, that, you can do it, but... Uh, aluminum brown... Oh, aluminum brown siding. I don't know what you did. I don't know. Uh, oh, you painted, you painted that wall, and, and good for you. I don't have a problem with that, but I, that's not what I'm going to do. I'm going to go you. In fact, cancel, cancel, and just so you just bring this back to uh, uh, page one. Hit the spray can. Uh, use default material. Spray that wall. Ah, see, see, you had painted that wall, and I get that, I, and that's not a bad thing. I think some people say don't do it, but I like your style. You, so now all you have to do is go here, siding, and select this, and change it to uh, aluminum brown siding, aluminum brown siding, and you don't have to paint the wall. But that's that's neither, you know, what you did is fine. See, oh, oh. You. What happened? What kind of wall is this? Because uh, you painted these things. Uh, you, you did something. F what did you do? You define this. Oh, that's right. Okay. Okay. I don't know what you did. Hang on a second. I, 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 I'm sorry. I'm trying to figure this. That, that's the deal. I'm trying to figure out your what you did here before I could do what I want to do. Oh, component. Okay, that, that's the wall I want. What kind of wall is this here? Let's see if I can paint it. I don't know how much painting you did. I'm, I'm undoing the painting, but I'm not complaining about what you did on the painting. I, I, I think, I think if you know what you're doing, it works out fine. Okay, that, that's the wall you got. So. This wall here is, uh, what kind of wall is this? Copy of siding 6. Okay, perfect. Tab. U. Wall type. Copy of siding 6. Copy of siding. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Right there, you nitwit. Yeah. Okay, perfect. And so the whole point of this was, if you make that paint layer thin enough, let's turn off our line weights, okay? If you make your paint layer thin enough, I still didn't make it thin enough, but depending upon your wall thickness and elevation, you won't get that double line when you have a backlip cross-section. That's my point. Tab. 
ta- you. Look, I, I would make this. I think I think the thickness is uh, uh, probably one eighth of an inch. Oh, hang on, one eighth. Okay, and now that line's going to disappear. See, see, now it's really disappearing. Now I should take, take this wall here, you, and change this to uh, one eighth of an inch. I have made it. Put a paint layer on it. You get the idea, it, and it's, you, you watch the lay, uh, wall layer videos, and you'll understand what I'm talking about. So now, now I'm going to try the one other method, and that is your balloon frame method. Now, with your balloon frame method, let's just see what happens. You, because here's my goal. My goal is to take this tower that you have and put it on level two. And I can't put it on level two right now, I don't think, because you've got this wall right here on level two. Now, none of these are, these aren't even room def walls, are they? These are what, attic walls? I don't even know what they are. You. What kind of, now you, you see this right here? If you have this, it means that some of those are non-room def and some are room def. Some are no lo locate and some are locate and some are attic walls and some are not so I don't know what we want to do with them what is this is that a, what kind of wall is that enough uh, it's 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 a, it's a real wall what kind of wall is this oh see now you get all this fancy stuff here here's my here's my question can I just delete these three walls let's see what happens if I delete them yeah I delete them perfect so now let's go down to here and take this wall here you and balloon through ceiling. You think that's going to work? There it is. Okay? And I think this was Perry's, Perry's suggestion. And so you come over to here, tab, tab, you. Oh, boy. Balloon through ceiling. If, if that's what you want. But I think, I think what's happened here is you, you might have a bit of a gap. Uh, I'm not going to get into that. Uh, that's your own deal. You, you you do it your own way. But what I said is I wanted to, to, to now take these three, these four, these four walls right here. Control save. File save is number two. I want to take these three, these four walls here and put them on the lower level. That's all I want to do. In fact, I'm going to do I do them all at the same time. Control C. Go down a level. Six, put them there. Not good. It didn't work, did it? Let's see if I can delete. These are the attic wall deals. Delete. I think I'm sort of surprised it didn't work, I think. You. Yeah, see, that roof cuts wall at bottom. And uh, there. oh, there it is right there. Yeah, see, that's sort of, I'm not sure if I completely understand that. Let's take a look at what this wall looks like. You. Full gable wall structure. Doggone it. See, that's not really what I wanted. Uh, okay, let's do Larry's note issue. Let's 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 work with. Let's see if we can work with Larry's. Note. I don't like to do this. Believe me, I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. I think it's there. And so I now I sort of did it. Uh, maybe you would already done it this way. I don't know you. Now see, this is default wall top height is is not correct anymore. It goes back down to that. See, I don't like to do that. I like it to be automatic. I like it to be automatic. I'm try something here. This is a room. You. Uh, general. No room def. There you go. I just did it. I just, I, I mean, I just did it. Did you just see what I just did? I made this thing not, not to have a room depth on it. 
and and now and now we've got uh, these walls on level one and this on level two. Uh, I, I could should I go on? I'll go on a little bit further. Go on a little bit further because I'm having so much fun. Now here's here's something that uh, sometimes we do. Watch this. Shift P. This time, see this roof goes like this and like this. Now suppose I suppose I don't want suppose I don't want the roof to be. Uh, anyway, suppose I don't want what I want. I'll show you what I don't want. Uh, subtract. Delete original. Now I'm and I see, see the shape of the roof now. See what I just did? That's the shape of the roof, which is which is what you had in the very beginning. I, I get that. So now I'm going to come over here. Uh, subtract polyline subtraction from here. Delete original. Perfect. Now let's see what happens with this. Because I think I know what's going to happen, and and this kind of goes back to the dormers. I did tons of dormer videos when when I had nothing better in my life to do. So let's take a look at, and this is still non-room def. So let's go down here and take a look at this. In fact, let, let's let's take a, and let's not even put a well. Let, let's leave the ceiling on there for right now. Let's see what we get. Okay, Shift J. I'm downstairs at the first floor. And I'm going to look up here, uh, F6. That's what we expect to see, right? So now let's go down here, you, and not put a ceiling on this. Now let's see what happens. There you go. Isn't that kind of cool? You see what I just did there? And now if you want, you can come over here and you can put a little little bitty, 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 bitty window right, right there. Right there. How about 24 and 24 and fixed glass? Fixed glass. See what see what see what's happening? Yeah, you, you get the idea. And I and I did a lot of these uh uh dormer uh, is this a dormer, dormer tower, whatever videos. I think they were pretty kind of cool. Now I get I get into all sorts of funny things and and I think the the magic here was um I had gone up to this level here. And I had made one of these rooms a non-room def, which meant this wasn't a room anymore. Now, if I want this to be a room, and I'm not sure why I would, but just suppose I wanted this to be a room. If I wanted this to be a room. And I wanted to have your... I, I, I'm done. Hey, you know, I, I can go... Oh yeah. Oh, by the way, because I did this balloon frame, you, you you lose the fact that you have two different wall materials. Yeah, I, I lost the fact. That, yeah, I got to go back and restate that because I did this. I lost the you know the vertical siding here at the bottom and the horizontal siding in the gable end. So if you want to, if you want that, okay. Let me see if I can go back. Let me see if I can go back. You uh, structure. I'm gonna I'm gonna reverse it. I'm gonna reverse it to go back to what you had in the very beginning, right? Oh, this will be interesting. Check this out. How about you? Hi. Hey, this is a, this is a good one. Uh, balloon through ceiling. Okay. But you said, wait, wait, wait. I want I want the the vertical siding up on top, right? So you go you, let's go ahead and uh, general uh, wall. Can I start my timer? Why do you start my timer? Oh shoot! Sorry guys, uh, I, I, I might make this make this a pony wall. Make this copy of siding there. Make this siding six. Make this I don't know. Eight foot. Let's see what happens. There you go. There you go. And you understand that you can under. Uh, okay, I made it a pony wall. I, I did what you wanted, I think. And, ad and ad adjust this thing. You. If you want a little bit higher, make it 108. I don't care. There you go. 
And I still have this wall. Okay. Now I'm going to reverse this. And I'm going to make, turn this into a room again. General. I, I, you don't want to watch this yet. And, and see, and that's what happens to this thing. Because of that wall below. Look at where the seat look at look at where the floor is. Let's try something here. Oh, for, oh, how about if I do this? You open to below. Make it open to below. It doesn't have a floor anymore, okay? Now what happens? Oh. Okay, fine. It's still a problem, isn't it? So now suppose I uh F6, suppose I now you understand that the floor below is defined at that elevation right there, I guess. I don't know. But suppose I put the floor right there. What do you think is going to happen? You. 211. I'm going to make the floor for this structure here at 211. You. Structure. <laughs> 211. And the floor structure is going to be, I'm just going to delete this. Nah, uh, I'm going to delete it for right now. Because I'm, I'm going to see if I fixed it. There you go. Another way of doing it. And now I can make this open. It is open to below. Oh, but I, I do have a... Uh, ain't, that, ain't that interesting. Is it open to below? Oh, I don't know. Maybe not. Oh, you. Structure. Delete. Delete. Let's delete the whole thing. It didn't work. Okay. Oh, because this thing has a ceiling on it. You, take off the ceiling. No ceiling, no roof. Yep. See now, see, see now what happened? And now you just, if, if you want a ceiling on it, here, here, you put, put a ceiling, no, here, I, I want, I want to put a ceiling at this level here. You, what, what, what elevation is that? Lock this, lock this, lock this. That's the elevation, 244. That's the elevation of my ceiling. So now I come over here and I, you, and I <laughs> change the ceiling height. Is this what I changed? That ceiling height? No, that's relative. This is the absolute. Change that to 244. And you give it a ceiling. And I guess you get a roof. Ah, now, you, now you got this in there, don't you? Now, a byproduct of that was this funny thing right in here, which I don't know what that is. I think that's a glitch, uh, a bug, buggerino. I don't know. It's, it's, that's what you're looking at right there. And I probably should raise this floor up just a little bit higher. You, the floor, make the floor at uh, 220, I guess. And you, you, I don't know if you saw it, but a little triangle went away right there, right there. So now I just take this window down, window, boop, boop. Oh, not high enough. Put it right there. Perfect. Hey. Oh, boy. Boy, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, Gail. I did it for you, I think. That was, I thank you for the uh, question. I think it was a, it was really, really good. Um, I think, uh, well, I learned some things, I think. Or reinforced some things. There's a lot of things, you know, I, I did it a lot of different ways. And, and since I, since I understand, a pretty good understanding of how all this kind of goes together. There are many different ways I can do it, and I can come up with a lot of different options. You know, do, do I want this to be a room? Do I not want this to be a room? Do I want a flat ceiling on or not flat, flat ceiling? See, i got a ceiling right there. I can take the ceiling out. This little thing right here bugs me. I've seen that before on one of my plants, and I don't think there's anything there. There's nothing there. I, I don't know why that's the, I don't know why I get that double line there, because as you saw, as I looked into here, Let's, let's let's see where that is. You, you you think you know where it is? Oh, hang on. Yeah, see, it's nothing. I think it's a bug. I think it's a bug. And the problem is when you take a back clip cross section, you're going to see those lines unless you stop the camera just short of that wall, and then you won't see the lines, but then you won't see the window, and that's done. End of part two. Thank you very much, for, uh, Gail, for the question. Great question. Thank you.